it's Kathy Andronicu, and today I'm going to show you how to create this card using the iridescent creative mediums. To begin, I've created my own stencil using SRM Stickers Heavyweight Stencil Sheet and Penny Black's Soft Caress Die. The stencil sheet has an adhesive backing, so I'm able to place it on my black card and get a nice firm adhesion. This will help prevent any paste from slipping underneath. I then take the positive part of the stencil and cut off the hearts and use them as masks. I can then place the green paste directly onto the stencil without worrying about it going into the heart area. Using the Chateau's iridescent creative medium and the trowel palette knife, I spread a small amount over the stems, making sure that it is applied evenly over the stencil. Any excess is then scraped away and placed back inside the pot. I then take the pink iridescent creative medium. I remove my masks that I placed on earlier. And again, using my trowel palette knife, evenly spread the medium over the hearts. Because the knife has a nice narrow edge, I don't need to mask off the areas that I've already covered with paste. Then using a doodle sticks taper point, I carve some little S's into each of the hearts to create a pattern. This is random and no particular order at all, each time wiping the excess paste off of my doodle sticks as I go. Once this is finished, I'm then ready to carefully peel off my mask. I lift in one direction and pull backwards away from the paste very carefully so as not to catch the paste as I pull it off. I then leave to dry before reapplying the stencil and repeating the process. I've cut round one side of the card and now I'm going to add some irresistible neon pink Pico embellisher. Always test off on a scrap piece of paper first to get rid of any air bubbles and then apply with little dots to the blank card. It's hard to see here but in real light you can see the little dots shining through. Once your irresistible Pico dots have dried, you can then add a sentiment. I have used the Be Mine die from Penny Black and some black card and used Stick It to adhere to my card. Thanks for joining me today. For more great project ideas, check out Imagine Crafts on Facebook, Pinterest and at imaginecrafts.com.